Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com with a full case break of 2019 Panini Donner's Optic Baseball 12 box pick your team number 14. Very big thanks to all of these people right here. Now if you have a little rooftop next to your name, that means you got that spot in a team random. Also, quick note, Daniel Patera, if you watch the team random video, it says you got the Red Sox, but actually Stephen Olson, we made a mistake. Stephen Olson had purchased the Red Sox straight up earlier today. So it shouldn't have been on that list, so we refunded you. So you should be able to see that. If you don't see it in your account, definitely hit us up, let us know. And there's everyone right there. And David, last spot mojo, Nationals. It's been a minute or two since we've seen a full caser of this 2019 Panini Donners Optic Baseball. So let's get into it. Good luck, folks. these back here give myself a little room to work hot boxes as well there's usually two hot boxes two autograph hot boxes and two uh oh there you are daniel yeah sorry about that uh two autograph hot box two parallel hot boxes but yeah i think nick said he was going to take care of it soon i just i messaged him about 15 minutes ago so should be taken care of some point time thanks you still got the astros though you, you had you got a couple spots so all right, good luck, everybody. Now, this break should take about an hour or so. So it's 8 o'clock on the West Coast. This brings us, this break will bring us to the right up to the last hour of the broadcast. Now, do we want to do something else tonight? I don't know. I see Greg and Marlon with an order. I'm not sure what they ordered, but if there's something you want to get into, let's do it. I think we'll be, by the time this break is over, we'll probably be too late to do the 22-box football mixer. We still have time to do the 9-box basketball mixer. Also, tonight's promo, we extended it for you guys. It's going to be, uh, the deadline is now tomorrow night. We should definitely be able to do it by tomorrow. We, we put in a lot of work. We got a lot of spots moving tonight. We should be able to finish it off tomorrow and then give away some money. Only the three breaks on the site, jazbeescasebreaks.com, are eligible. Now, other stuff we can do tonight, we can squeeze in another unparalleled football. That's something we can definitely do tonight. There's only 15 teams left. We're halfway there. We can do we can do another Bowman Sterling. That's about an hour. That we can make that if that fills by the end of this break, that would be the last break of the night. We'd be too late for Heritage, I'm afraid. That'll be tomorrow. That's like an hour and a half, two hour break. Nine box mixer. We can do the Jaspies Fanatics. We can do a couple of those tonight if you want to. Jaspies Fanatics, autographed jerseys. We're only like six or seven breaks away from, uh, from selling out of all the boxes and then being able to run that hit list promo, give away that Austin Matthews jersey, etc. All right, so all of these will ship, obviously. It'll just be vet commons that won't ship. Inserts, of course, will ship. So something like that won't ship unless it was a refractor. Fernando Tatis Jr. will ship. That'll ship to Richard Z and the Padres. Rated prospect pink velocity autograph. Not numbered, but a nice hit. Nice way to start things off. Now, because Panini doesn't have to pay for the license, they can be a little more generous with, uh, with some of the bigger name rookies. That's safe. Oh. There's Eloy Jimenez to 125. Um, when we'll we'll uh, sleeve and top load all of those, our shipping team will take care of that. Just in the interest of time, we're just going to set those aside. But they'll be safe. Don't worry. 
We got Corey Kluber pink velocity. These are numbered. The auto auto pink velocities are not numbered. But there's Kluber to 199. And there's our second autograph. It's CNL Perez. And that's for the Astros. That's going to go to uh, Daniel, I believe. Yes, Daniel Patera with the Astros. Keston Hira to 125 for Rory and the Brew Crew. And that's box one. Didn't the Rangers have bases loaded at some point? Hmm. I thought they were... Come on, Rangers. We might have some more Sterling, Bob. We might have a chance to jump on that. Does Boston have any autos? I'm sure they do. Steve Olson. We wouldn't. How much did you pay for it? <laughs> Basically, if, if it's if it's uh, almost every team has autos. In a break like this, if they don't have autos, the team would be like ten bucks. Pack here. All right. Good luck, everybody. Really got to look at the look at those checklists, Steve Olson, before you buy. So then you're not you're not flying blind. All right. There is Bren Lau, pink velocity to 199. There's Keston Hira, 51 out of 75. Autograph for Rory, right on the card, too. Sterling's a very auto-heavy product. Indeed it is, Bob. Indeed it is. 60 autos a case. We've been having a lot of fun with, it, with those breaks. Anthony Rizzo well, to 125 for the Cubs. We'll save one of these Pete Alonzo's too for the Mets. So those get top loaded. They'll ship anyway. But we'll top load one of those. And there's Miles Straw, rated rookie autograph for Daniel Patera in the Strohs. That's number to 125. Wow, the Rangers had bases loaded, and did they squander all of those runners? Four outs on. Out of 125, Daniel. That's stunning. I also have financial interest in the uh, 
in the Rangers tonight too. So that's mind-boggling. Poor James and Tyon, another uh, another surgery for him. Out of 150, Steven Gonzalez for the Twins. That Royce Lewis, I don't think is numbered. No, it's not. That will ship though. It's a rated prospect card. All right, next box. I have not seen any of the hot boxes yet. Got a handful of active games right now. In the top of the sixth, the White Sox up on the Angels 5 to 2. In Colorado, Rockies leading the Marlins 9 11 to 3. Top of the eighth, Giants ahead of the Diamondbacks 9 to 4. Got this game on MLB Network. I guess regional coverage. Got Twins up 9 7 on the Rangers in Dallas. And it's game still going in Washington. It's 12-12. Brewers and Nats tied at 12 in the bottom of the 10th. Wow. Everyone had the over on that game, right? Man, these packs open up real smooth. If I was in a pack ripping contest, I would use 2019 Panini Donner's Office Baseball. All right. Good luck, everyone. There's Aaron Judge, All Stars, Pink Velocity to 199, Yankees. And we've got Kevin Kramer. Nice Kevin Kramer rated rookie autograph for the Pirates. George, who got the Pirates in a team random. I, think, I want to say, it was it Kevin Newman or Kevin Kramer? One of the Kevins, I think, hit a walk-off the other night. Maybe two nights, last night? Against the, uh, it's the Cubs, I think. There's Yachty. What card does that sound like? Yachty to 25. Black Refractor for the Cardinals. That'll be for Arthur. It was Kevin Newman. All right, so not Kramer. Ryan O'Hearn almost had a grand slam yesterday. There's his autograph. That's for the Royals. Travis Melber got the Royals in a team random. And is this Kevin Newman? All right, there you go. That guy hit the walk off the other night. It's another pirate going out to George. That sounds like a Dodge. Challenger. Charger. I don't know. So this might be the autograph hot box. There's three already. There's another one. John Duplantier, rated prospect autograph. For Richard Z and the Diamondbacks. Richard got the Diamondbacks in a team random. And the fifth autograph? There is no fifth autograph. Four autographs here. I thought it was a five autograph hot box. Yeah, five autographs or 20 numbered parallels. Am I missing an autograph? Missed that. Was, was Miles? No, Miles Straw and Keston Hero was box two. <laughs> Sorry, guys. 
And that's the 50 that'll go to the Red Sox. Maybe there'll be a bonus auto in the next box. All right, Bob Heard race car. Apparently the, the grounds crew in Texas have not drawn the chalk all the way to the foul pole. All right, next one. A lot of games are final scores, ladies and gentlemen. I think we had a full slate of games today. Yankees beat the Indians 6-5. to five. Cubs shut out the Pirates 2-0. to nothing. Mariners beat the Blue Jays 4-3. to three. And the A's beat the Astros 8-3. to three. In, in extras, in 13 innings, Tampa Bay walked it off. They beat the uh, Tigers 1 to nothing. 13 innings of 0 0 ball. Uh, Cardinals fell to the Reds. Reds won 6 1. Padres beat the Phillies 5 3. Red Sox shut out the Orioles 4 0. Mets beat the Royals 4 1. And the Braves edged out my Dodgers 4 3. Can you imagine going like 12, 13 innings without a run? How many hits were in that game? There's a walk-off single, too. Oof. That's a combined nine hits in the entire game. Tigers only had three hits the entire in 13 innings. And the Rays only had six hits in 13 innings. And one run. It's kind of rough. box here we go looks like Jonathan Loisaga is our first autograph rated rookie auto going to George who got the Yankees straight up twenty one out of one twenty five there's Anthony Rizzo you can kind of see the sparkliness in the background that's to one twenty five I forget what that's called. It's called something. And we got another Kevin Kramer. Another Pirates autograph for George. Twenty six out of seventy five on that one, starting your Kevin Kramer PC. There's Trout, all stars to fifty. That's to the gap in right center field. Santana will get over to cut it off. And Cave will hold up with a single, so good at that for Cave, his second hit. And get There's Bland Brandon Lau to one fifty. We got Justice Sheffield. Justice is served to the Mariners. That'll be for Travis Melberg. That's autograph three. And then we've got Usnail Diaz, signature series autograph. So it's another four auto box. That's for the Orioles, SKS with the O's. Got him in a team random. All right, next box.
You got him. Oh, that's safe? Wow. That's safe. This batch is not opening well. <laughs> Different glue. All right. Next box, we've got an early autograph here. It's Ryan Baruki. Blue Jays, that's going to be for Richard Z. Got Garrett Cole, orange to 99. Looks like a parallel hot box here. Out of 150, Nolan Arenado, red, white, and blue. That Willie Calhoun is a refractor. There's Shohei Otani. We got Javier, but maybe not an autograph or a parallel hot box. On this side here, right. there's Loriano. And we got Vlad Guerrero Jr. Pink Velocity, 149 out of 199 for Richard and the Blue Jays. And woo, look at that! Is that him? It is autograph. Yes. Rated rookie on card auto Vlad Guerrero Jr. for Richard Z and the Blue Jays. Wow, that was salty. Twins, Twins, uh, announcer. All right. Next box. Good luck, everybody. So this will this will put us halfway through this break. We are. I think we're on. Just about right on target. Time wise, in this break. Box six right here. Good luck. Oh, yeah, I know. I saw that, Don. Vlad Jr. left the game today because of a knee issue. Seems like some sort of ongoing problem with a ligament in his knee. Which is a shame because it looks like Tatis Jr. is going to be out for the remainder of the season, the next month and a half, because of, I think, lower back spasms or something like that. And then we may lose Vlad Jr. for an extended period of time. I think that pretty much ensures that Pete Alonso is going to get NL Rookie of the Year. 
I think Vlad Guerrero Jr. had has has had some great moments, but I don't think he was going to quite get there rookie of the year wise. So what's the AL situation looking like rookie wise? Uh, it's got to be Jordan Alvarez at this point, right? Brandon Lau actually has a slightly better war than Jordan Alvarez. But Brandon Lau's missed some games. He's on the been on the IL, I think. But, I mean, Jordan Alvarez has, has, has like 100 fewer plate appearances and already has a 2.4 war. Already has as many home runs as Brandon Lau, 17. More than Brandon Lau at this point. 52 RBIs. Looks like it's going to be Jordan Alvarez. I think Luis Areas is having a good season too, but I don't think he's going to quite get there. Are there maybe pitchers that could that could fight for the AL Rookie of the Year situation? Spencer Turnbull might get some votes if he wasn't on the Tigers. His win loss is three and eleven. If it was eleven and three, I feel like it'd be different because he's got a pretty decent ERA, three seven five. He's got a two three WAR. It's pretty high for a, for a pitcher there. All right, there's Kyle Wright to 199, pink velocity for the Braves. Chris Parent has the Bravos. There's Rowdy Tellez for the Blue Jays to 35. And, wow, another Vlad Guerrero Jr. rated rookie autograph. That's another one for Richard Z, who picked up the Blue Jays straight up. Back to back Vlads. We got signature series. Corey Ray for the Brew Crew, Rory. And this is a green parallel, which usually means. Yes! Five out of five, Signature Series Corey Ray for Rory's Brewers. There you go, Rory. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop, whoop. There's Eddie Rosario to 199. All right, so there are your two autos. We have not seen the parallel hot box yet. We saw the two uh, autograph hot boxes, but there were four auto hot boxes instead of the usual five, which is a bummer. Maybe we'll find a box with an extra autograph in here somewhere. Balance it all out. I don't know. Who's everyone having in the, in the AL Rookie of the Year? I'm thinking it's got to be Jordan Alvarez at this point. What does everyone have for NL MVP? NL MVP, which is generally an offensive award. Um, Bellinger has a 6.7 war. Christian Yelich has a 6.0 war. Got very similar numbers. 
Bellinger has 41 home runs. Yelich has 39. Bellinger has 94 RBIs. Yelich has 85. Yelich has, uh, has a little more stolen bases. He has 23 to Bellinger's 10. Yelich already has a 20-20 season. Could have a 30-30 season if they let him keep stealing. So Yelich has more stolen bases, but Bellinger is better defensively. He's got a 2-7 Defensive war, while Yelich has a minus 2.8 defensive war. All right, next box. So that'll, that'll be an interesting race. There's Jose Barrios and Ozzy Albius to 75. We got Austin Riley, nice rated rookie, on-card autograph Austin Riley for the Braves. Chris Parent with the Bravos. There is Pink Velocity, Giancarlo Stanton to 199 for the Yankees. Victor Victor Mesa. Vlad Guerrero Jr., the rookie's refractor. And we got for the O's, Cedric Mullins. Rated rookie auto for SKS, who got randomized the Orioles. Wow. Twins Pet Appreciation Day. They got Joe Meower. And then we got Barkston right there, too. Ooh. That's a good promo, Twins. That's a really good promo. I dig it. There's Chris Paddock, rated rookie to 35 for the Padres. Yeah, we still haven't seen the parallel hot box yet. We're kind of running out of boxes here. <laughs> James saying rough Indians box. We got. There's got to be some Indians in here. Got to be some Lindors maybe. Some Tristan McKenzies would be nice. No, not yet, Steve Olson. We still have one. Two, three, four, five balls. We still have half the break to go, ladies and gentlemen. Let's not get too concerned yet. Let's find some, well, yeah, we'll find some Victor Victor in here. Travis, what's the vector, Victor? We've got clearance, Clarence. I can't believe the Marlins actually drafted both of the Mesas, just to make it confusing for all of us. I have a buddy, a good buddy of mine, whose family have has been in, um, whose family has done an NL only fantasy baseball league since the 80s for a long time. And one of their, one of the guys in the group just recently and so it's NL and it's like prospects and stuff like that too. It's wild. There's a lot, a lot of minor league players and, and stuff too. And uh, 
one guy made the mistake of saying they wanted to add Victor Mesa to their team to draft Victor Mesa. So he drafted Victor Mesa. Drafted Victor Mesa Jr. What he really wanted was Victor Victor. Mistakes. Careful when you're drafting, folks. Um, I don't know if he's going to be selling his collection, Cleveland Rocks, but I think he'll have... I think Bossman, that's for you, Richard, uh, John Duplanty. I think he will, he will uh, unveil, unearth some of, his, uh, some of his collection from storage and start showing that off. The shop. I don't know. Maybe they'd be for sale if someone made the right offer, but I don't think he's actively selling it, though. Nine out of ten. Michael Kopech. Nice one for the White Sox. TJ. With the White Sox. There you go, Tej. Nice low number on that. Flamethrower. But he's got all sorts of memorabilia. I almost want to say not a lot of it is cards. So it's a lot of cool, like, ephemera from over the years. There's Danny Jansen, rated rookie autograph for the Bluebirds. Richard Z with that. They might be for sale. I don't know. Mrs. Bossman might want some of that for sale. Although we have the shop now, so it'll be all out. Of, it'll be all out of there. But he's got a lot of uh, he's got a lot of cool ephemera. I want to say at a 199 Carter Keyboom. like letters from old ball players from back in the day. There's Mookie Betts to 76. That's part of the We the People. You know, it's very patriotic parallel here, which I, I dig. That's Mookie Betts for the Red Sox. Nice Pete Alonzo, rated rookie silver or refractor, whatever they call this in this set. Can't keep track. Cleveland Rock says, but your wife wants your stuff gone? Open a card shop. <laughs> Open a hobby shop. Send some stuff to us. We'll, we'll, we got a lot of space to fill. All right, next box. I see some orders coming in. What what do people want to do? I see order from Greg, Marlon, Michael, and Arthur Hackett. What are we thinking, folks? I don't know what's actually at a glance. I'm not sure what's moving right now on the site. I see a couple spots gone. That Jaspie's fanatics. We, def we definitely have time to do a couple more of that tonight. But this break will be over in about 20 minutes. And then we'll be into our last hour of the broadcast. So maybe we can squeeze in a couple more short breaks, maybe a couple of those Jaspie's Fanatics breaks before we close out the night. We have a shot at doing, we have time to do that nine box basketball mixer, but don't, I haven't seen a lot of spots moving there. So maybe, maybe that will be a tomorrow break. I'm not sure if we're gonna be doing consignment things. I know we, we talked about, um, possibly selling kind of bigger hits that we pull from breaks for people directly to the shop in exchange for break credit. But I'm not sure if we will have some other stuff going on in terms of like like doing like consignment. Maybe. I don't know. We haven't crossed that bridge yet. Arthur <laughs> just wants just wants something. He's like, come on Anchor, it's just something for the Rockies. There's gotta be some Rockies in there. Ryan McMahon, or Brendan Rogers, some of those up and coming prospects for the Rockies.
All right, next box. Definitely running out of steam here, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Definitely slowing down. Reese Hoskins to 35. We're looking for this guy, Wander Franco, among others. Oh, there he is. Victor Victor Mesa. Rated prospect autograph for Travis Melberg. I may not be on a, on a lot of mainstream radars right now, but if, you're, if you like to collect prospects, that, that's one to keep an eye on for sure. We got Dakota Hudson, rated rookie autograph for the Cardinals. That's for Arthur. There you go, Arthur. A little something. Making some starts for the Cardinals this year. Brad Keller, pink velocity to 199 for the Royals. Travis Melberg got the Royals in the team random. Anthony Rendon to 75. I don't think the Rangers are winning this one, folks. All right. Oh, you're welcome, McCarthy. I'll have to check Twitter on that. McCarthy and I should work out how to do some sign language. You know, work on some American sign language. National still tied at 12 in the top of the 12. Drew Kerr, what's going on? He's asking, what's breaking next? How's it going, man? Uh, I don't know. Nothing sold out at the moment. We're, we would be into the last hour of the broadcast by the time I'm done with the, these final boxes here. So... I don't know. We don't have time for a lot of the breaks on the site, but come on, packaging. Oh, bench is clearing in Texas. But um, we do have time to do a couple of those Jaspies Fanatics jersey breaks. People want to do that. Oh, bullpen getting their calisthenics in. They're they're jogging out to the. To the gathering. It's not really a fight, it's just a gathering. <laughs> so I don't know. What should we do? There's David Peralta to 150. There is Pete Alonzo, optic autographs. Nice. Who's got the Mets? Richard Z. With the Metropolitans. 41 out of 50. Man, it seemed like just yesterday when people like Pete Alonzo, you know, in spring training, like, he's hitting some dingers. He looks kind of good. He just kept going. Hasn't stopped hitting.
A Griffey Jr. now? Travis is asking. Maybe. Well, we still got plenty of break to go. Why not? There's Garrett Hampson. Pink Velocity autograph for the Rockies. Arthur got the Rockies in a team random. Is on the board. Chris Shaw. Out of 125 for the Giants. There's Paul Goldschmidt to 75. All right, two boxes to go. We have not seen the parallel hot boxes yet, so I'm assuming one of these have got to be it, right? If not both? I guess we'll find out. Good luck, everybody. This does look like the parallel hot box. Good news. All right, is this the auto on top? All right, I guess that's what they're that's how they're gonna roll. Rated rookie autograph for the Brew Crew, Corbin Burns. That's gonna go to Rory and his Brewers. All right, there's Brandon Crawford to 50. There it is, Luis Ortiz to 199. Parallel hot box. Joey Votto to 125. Colby Allard, We the People to 76. Sean Reed Foley to 125. Kyle Tucker. Autograph to 125. That'll be for Daniel Patera and the Astros. Josh James also for the Astros going to you, Daniel, to 199. Trey Mancini to 199. Pink Velocity. Jose Martinez to 50. I really like that blue color on the out of 50s. Miguel Andujar to 199, Pink Velocity. Max Muncy, Black Parallel, 3 out of 25, had a solo shot today. Pete Alonso, Refractor. Walker Bueller to 199, Pink Velocity for the Dodgers. Scooter Jeanette to 50. Nelson Cruz to 125. Mike Fultonevich. 99, faulty. 58 out of 99 for the Braves. Kevin Kramer to 99. Jesus Aguilar to 35. Out of 125. Dar Darwinzon. Darwinzon. Hernandez. 35 out of 125 for the Red Sox. Walker Bueller again. There's Mitch Hanniger for the Mariners to 125. Harrison Bader to 70 to 99 
And Framber Valdez out of 10 for the Astros. Nice. Four left in Topps Heritage. Nice. That'll be a good break for tomorrow, Flipcoin. Unfortunately, we do not have time for that break tonight. It's like an hour and a half, two hour break, and we're already in the last hour of our broadcast. But that'll be a good one for tomorrow. I'm glad it's that close. I can run that team randomizer tonight if that sells out. The break itself will be tomorrow. All right, last box. Good luck. Cross those fingers. It's a final in Arizona. San Francisco beat the Diamondbacks 11-6. to I was almost on the Diamondbacks today. What's crazy, Steve Olson? Yeah, we can still run the randomizer tonight, flip coin. It's not crazy, Steve Olson. I, I, we talked about this last night. The, the chance of you not hitting are going to be, in the long run, probably greater than hitting. Even in 12-box breaks like this. No, George not happy either. Oh, let's see what we got here. All it takes is one one big hit to make up for it. All right. Bryce Wilson. Caleb Fur. I don't know why these are turned around like this, but all right, there you go. There's Kyle Tucker. Astros, Daniel Patera. We got Bryce Wilson, red, white, and blue to 150. Charlie Blackman to 125. This is the last hot box, uh, parallel hot box. To 150, Bryce Wilson. Keston Hira to 60. Sean Newcomb to 99. We got Brian Anderson to 125. We got Brian Anderson to 50. We got Luis Urias to 199. Pink Velocity for the Padres. We got Max Muncy for the Dodgers to 199. We got Carlos Carrasco. That's to 60, looks like. 33 out of 60 for the Tribe. Got Miggy, Miguel Cabrera to 99. We got Michael Conforto for the Mets. That's to 199. Matt Carpenter, red, white, and blue for the Cardinals. 150. And 18 out of 99, Steven Duggar. Orange parallel for the Giants. 18 out of 99. Still looking for the second auto of the box here. There's Lorenzo Kane to 76. We the People parallel. Chris Davis, pink velocity to 199. Justin Smoke, pink velocity to 199. There's Jose Barrios to 60. We've got Joey Gallo to 125. And that's it. Hmm. Parallel Hotbox only had one autograph. What a weird break. All right. Well, sorry, guys. That's, that's how this cookie crumbles. Did I miss it? No. Sorry, guys.
Kyle Tucker closes things up, but we did get our parallels in that last parallel hot box. Thanks for watching, everybody. That was 2019 Panini Donners Optic Baseball. We'll see you next time for the next break. Bye-bye.